Welcome back to my channel, Virgos. How y'all doing tonight? All right, so this is a no communication read for y'all. This commu no communication read is going to be looking at someone you're not talking to and how they feel about you. Please drop a like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification button. All right, thank you support, uh, for all your support, love, likes, shares. Also, for those who have ordered on my Amazon wish list, thank you. Check it out if you guys like to send me some type of tarot deck that you would love me to use, okay? For you out there, my Virgos. Also, check out my Miss Wild watches or originals. If you guys would like to, or any type of watches, crystals, or uh, sunglasses, eyeglasses, okay, uh, for my little boutique. And if you like to book a reading with me, check out simplybookme.com. All right, so why is this person not talking to you, Virgo? All right, what's the block in the communication? We have death. Oh, okay, so something needed to end okay scorpio season all right yeah we have here eight of swords some of y'all this person is not talking to y'all because they locked up or something is like got them caught up in the web got gemini scorpio we got the sun card also something you can't something came to light okay and we got the two of cups wow this person loves you and they could be in another relationship cancer okay Venus and Cancer, and we have hit a star, okay? So it could be Aquarius or the fact that this person is, like, dealing with another kid or something. And let's see what else is going on. So I feel like their wishes is being squashed. That's why this person hasn't reached out to you. Judgment with the Three of Cups. This person is also stuck in a situation where they're having a hard time deciding what they want to do. I'm I'm on the edge. I feel like this person is on the edge too. Cause I'm like, I gotta um adjust here. All right, this is so much better. I think. Ooh wee. <laughs> All right. All right. So um, that's why some of them stuck, locked up, or they need to end something with a a kid's kids cancer uh, Gemini. All right. So. That's why they, um, this is why they're not communicating with you. They don't know what to say. Some of them just stuck, okay? Is there anything else blocking this person from talking to you? Four of Wands, Ace of Swords, the Two of Swords, and it's Nine of Cups. This person is like, <laughs> they can't make up their mind whether they they come to you and make a home. Some of them could be the fact that they don't have stability. There's a choice here, too, that they're having that's making it hard for them to see. Libra, Aries, okay, Nine of Cups, Pisces, Energy. Uh, this person, the block is to also, this person doesn't see their own flaws for what they are, Nine of Cups. Some of you guys are this person wish fulfillment. I do feel like this person has an addiction here, all right? What their action will they take? We have here the nine of one. Some of you guys is a Sagittarius and they want to say they sorry or they tired or they're not willing to give up. We got the five of swords. It's a mind game. <laughs> we have here three of swords. I feel like this person, like it's not whatever they doing, it's not working. We had justice, okay? <laughs> yeah, also they could be dealing with some legal things. And then we had a hangman. Yeah, this person is hung up or this person is caught up in some legal things. The devil, this person could be in some type of contractual toxic agreement here. Five of swords, nine of one. I feel like this person really, really want to be with you. And I feel like this person is kind of ruthless as well. That want to come towards you. Aquarius, Libra, Pisces or Sagittarius. Their action is like, I do whatever it takes by any means necessary to hurt your feelings, break you down before I give you something. I don't think I like this person. So if you guys locked in, pretty good for you. All right. Yeah, this person is losing their mind. All right. They unstable and unbalanced is why they're not talking to you guys. Some of them could be dealing with somebody that's unstable and imbalanced. This person pose a lot of fears. Okay. This person wants to reach out. Strong Sagittarius here. Scorpio. Aquarius and Leo. Then we got Cancer Pisces. Uh, yeah, this person is like unstable. The outcome, all right, for y'all. <sighs> Judgment with the Nine of Cups. This person wants to come in and have another chance. A lot of love here. Wow, a lot of love. Judgment, Nine of Cups, Page of Cups, King of Cups. 
And then we have here the page of source. Yeah, this person like, huh? But they hold back. This person like stingy. They want to use you for sex and everything else. Capricorn energy. Your advice here, Queen of Swords Day. So I feel like you guys just don't play games, and this person knows that. Page of ones, they you know. You are good to listen to your senses, world card. I feel like you know this person it needs some growing up to do. Very immature. Um, this person is very immature. Some of you guys are being asked to ghost this person. You could be double-minded about this because you care about this person. Ten of Cups. This could be um, because you have a family with this person. Did you do the right thing by not talking to this person? Nine of Ones. This is hard for you just as much as it is for this person. All right. This is a struggle. Trying. Full card, yeah. They said take a new leap of faith. Four of cups. This person is like not giving up, but this person holding you back, or this person is holding back from this reconciliation. I don't know to irritate you. Yeah, so I feel like you go. Let's see the love message, because I feel like you guys did the right thing when it comes to like not talking to this person. This person is holding a lot back too. Um, they are like unstable, unbalanced. This person needs some help. We have playfulness, recapture the romance, allow your young, youthful self to shine through. So Capricorn energy. I feel like this person, um, they want to, they come off very uh, stoic, stoic and shit, and um, <laughs> they come off very stoic. This person is like coming in, trying to be smiling and happy honeymoon, enjoy the bliss of holidays together. And we have here, let your, uh, what did it say? Let your Love yourself first. Your self-respect make you romantically attractive. So insecurity with that nine and one. This person has deep insecurities as well, Virgo. That's why they're not talking to you. What else is the block with this person? Ace of one. Some of y'all. This is the fact they want a new beginning. Queen of ones. It could be a Leo that's blocking them from coming towards you. Or this is a Leo having problems. Eight of cups. Abandoning responsibility. Abandoning the Pisces. Abandoning the emotion. Stability. Yeah, I feel like this person wants to be with you. You are a blessing to talk to you. But it is a Leo that is a devil in their life. Um, Nine of swords. Sagittarius. They do think about contacting you. And they do think about wanting to have reconciliation with you. The other woman, okay, or the other man, temptress. But do you believe in magic? All right, so this person could be doing magic to come back or come to y'all back into their life. But I just feel like this person doesn't have this person is coming towards y'all with the five of swords. Are uh, they're very envious and competitive and hateful, wants to get back? I just don't know about this person. We got new beginnings. Some of y'all, this person does want a new start with you guys, or this is why they can't talk to y'all. They have a new baby, a new beginning happening in their life. All right, so the fairy godmothers of hurdles a joyful news of a baby, the birth of a cherished ideal, protect and nurture your ideals as you would your own baby. Some of y'all, this person wants to know what you're doing new. All right, if you have anybody new in your life so they can come in, we have journey. So some of you guys, it could be a distance that's keeping you guys apart. We did have the world card there. All right, it's time to prepare for a journey. It may be in futurist or plan. Either way, make sure you're ready when the time comes. Pack your passport now. So some of you guys may be going on a journey with this person. Moderation, yeah, this person may be going on a journey to rehab or trying to get their stuff together. Seriously, this body may not be talking to you. I do feel like this person is doing a whole bunch of work on y'all. All right, they're trying to figure out how to get you back or how to make you smile again. Um, I feel like you guys are disappointed in this person. Um, but I still feel like this person hasn't completely lost hope in this situation. If there's something that you know you shouldn't be eating, try to eat mindfully and healthy. Although the fairy said a little bit of what you fancy is fine. All right, so this person knows that you know that um, that they've been doing something wrong. You could be keep trying to tell this person you need to stop doing that, stop smoking, stop drinking. And this person hard headed, y'all, very stubborn individual. All right, I'm like, do y'all have any other advice? Page of one, you guys may hear good news from this person. I feel like this person, this fire sign. <laughs> I can't tell if they got hate in their eyes, but this person is like staring you guys down. I feel like this person wants to tell you something, but then I feel like the conversation go left and then it's like you're blocked or you keep it professional. It's something about keeping this professional with this person when they call you that's going to help the conversation because the queen of swords kept coming up. So you guys did right until this person can get their stuff together. Also, if this person is dealing with a situation where they got to get divorced, that is also something that's blocking them where they need to um, clear up that situation before they can have a new beginning with you guys. All right, guys, please drop a like, share, comment. All right, love and light, love and light, everybody.